Yes, yes, your uh, screen is on presentation mode. You can. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. So, shall I start? Yes, sir. You can start. The energy of the mind is the essence of life. With this beautiful thought, I am Palak Agarwal, the session coordinator from class six. Shakuntala Devi. A very peaceful afternoon to honourable chief guests, Mr. Navan Sir, Principal Sir, Director Sir, Vice Principal Sir, teachers, and all my dear friends. On the behalf of Curiosity Club, on the behalf of Curiosity Club, I welcome you all for the this session, Aryan Sleep and Memory. It's a great honor for me to introduce our chief guest, Mr. Navan Sir. He he completed his education from NCRT Mysore. He moved to New Delhi for learning for completing his education in Jnu New Delhi School of Life Science. Now he is working on MBB company. I'm the MBB company in Bangladesh. Thank you, sir, for being with us. Now I would like to call our young motivational speaker, Navya, to continue with her curiosity talk. Yes, Navya, you can come. Navya? Hi, Pala Didi. Okay. Thank you, Paladidi. Whatever the mind of man can con presentation presentation of the group presentation. Thank you, Paladidi. Whatever the mind of man can conceive and believe, it can achieve. I am Navya Agrawal from grade 5th Arya Bhatta for this curiosity talk. Today is my topic is power of mind. A um, beautiful thought by Buddha. We are shaped, shaped by our thoughts. We become what we think. When the mind is pure, joy follows like a shadow that never leaves. There is nothing so disobedient as an undisciplined mind. And there is nothing so obedient as a disciplined mind. We are the result of thinking. How? 
um there are three points the three points are world a series of positive negative and neutral events second thought we understand the world of our thought process third mood now we dis, uh, respect based on react based on our thought and thinking process how to make our thinking powerful powerful thinking leads to powerful result be mindful here the dog is thinking that he is sitting um he is sitting with her it with its friend and the man is thinking about the money plane and car so because um, because the dog is the dog is happy because uh, it is only it is only thinking about one thing be aware of self talk do not uh do not talk like uh do not think that you, uh do not think negative things like do not say that uh, you can't do your mood is off don't say that only think the positive write yourself can't read yourself can't find solution um in the between of the problems there is say i am strong i am powerful i am amazing i, I can do anything and i everything just absorb your thinking after that your your mind power will be increase a disciplined mind leads to happiness and an undisciplined mind leads to suffering thank you all Thank you, Navya. Thank you, Navya. Thank you, Navya, for your wonderful speech. Now I would like to call our chief guest, Navan sir, to share with us his wisdom. Welcome, sir. Uh, first of all, I want to say good afternoon to all of you. and the second uh, yeah so thank you so much palak for introducing me and it was such a nice the way you introduced me and i really like the presentation of navya i really appreciate what you have presented because these things uh, are never uh, covered in our syllabus no you won't like regarding the emotional aspect now uh, actually now scientists they are thinking to uh incorporate in our syllabus how to control our emotion how to have like how to achieve happiness how to improve like our own thoughts that is called introspecting right thinking on your own thought so this is very important and i i feel like just as like we focus on our physical hygiene no by going for exercise eating good food we we should also think on our emotional hygiene if we think bad about other that means it is affecting us only no when we think bad about other when we get angry about other people basically it is consuming our own immune system right you do you do you all agree with me or not yes sir yes sir yes sir yes sir yes sir so yes sir yes 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 thank you thank you so much so i am going to uh, present my screen and let us discuss no what i have done research okay i hope you guys can see my screen yes 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 sir yes sir, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. okay so today in this uh, lecture actually we are not going to discuss something which is like uh, which we don't know before it is very common we, we all know okay so we are going to discuss about the sleep and memory so in sleep 
we are more specifically we are focusing on the REM sleep. So this we will know in this lecture. Okay, what is REM sleep? Now the first question which I'm having for all of you, I think uh, can you all like say one by one instead of saying at once? Okay. So my first question is, do we need a good night's nice sleep? Yes. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, we all agree. This we all know. But can you tell me one by one why we need a good night's sleep? Sir, can I? Why? Why we need a good night's sleep? Sir, can I? Can I, sir? Yes. 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 Sir, we need a very yes. good night's sleep because the the whole day we have done many works, so we have to give rest to our body. So that's why we need a good night's sleep. Okay, so basically, from sleep we get rest. And any other point I can get? Any yes, other sir. point I can get? From? Yes, yes yeah. sir. Can you tell me? Yes, sir. sir, we need good yeah, sleep because. Because yes, when, sir. sir, because in childhood yes, when we sleep, so our height gets increased. So to carry out some life processes, we need good sleep. Yes, exactly. That's so correct. you are saying we need good night sleep because for our physical growth and development, no, for proper physical growth and development, we need good night sleep. And any more point? Sir, we get make energy. Up. To get energy, so it's basically you're saying, if we have a good night's nice sleep, we will regain, like we will get the rest and we will be active tomorrow, right? Sir, so to take the rest, good things, sir, so that our body can work properly. We will not get ill. And yeah, yeah, yeah. Can, uh, can, can we take the rest so then our body will um, very. Not our tired feel. It's also energetic. Then you do next to uh, next day works very uh, ener energetic. Yeah, we will feel more energetic. Sir, so can I tell? Yes, yes. Go ahead, please. Uh, sir, uh, uh, we should take a good sleep because to uh, for good sleep we need uh, uh, to get good sleep. We have. Um, so I like it. Yes, yes uh, please go ahead. No, uh, one girl yes, is sir. saying, right? So one girl is saying, she is telling. Uh, let her complete, then you go. Sir. Yes? Uh, sir. Yeah. Yes, sir. Yeah, please continue. You were saying something, right? In middle, it, it glitches. Yes, sir. Actually, I get muted by me. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So, sir, we need good sleep to get, to be energetic next day. Yeah, so this is the same thing, no? To sleep is basically for getting rest. And, okay. Yeah. So one last point, no? Yes. We, we can't spend much time. Yes. You can ask. So shall I? Yeah, yeah. Oh, yes, sir. So we need a good night's sleep, sir. Help to regain the neurons, sir. But, uh, like uh, our brain has got very much stress for doing all the things so we need a night sleep to regain all the power of the brain and regain the neurons which has been restless yes yes so basically uh yeah you're absolutely correct when we sleep so what happened is so our brain the circulation happen no like in our body what flows in our body what what kind of transportation take place food and oxygen no? blood. and it takes place by the blood in our brain there is fluid called cerebrospinal fluid okay it flows better when we sleep so that means when we sleep so there is a better tra transportation of the cerebrospinal fluid so that's how our neurons get more energy and oxygen nutrients okay so now what you all have said know your points so it's absolutely correct so i'm going to add more points okay so if importance of sleep if we sleep obviously it will improve our immune system so the person who got proper sleep they will have a better immune system they will have a better cardiovascular health cardiovascular means related to heart okay and the one i'm focusing on is memory here 
Now, sleep, if you sleep better, you will have a better long-term memory. Now, let's dis uh, we, we will discuss on this further, okay? Now, the second thing. Now, this is about the physical hygiene, not physical. Now, it will also affect the cognitive ability. What is cognitive ability? What is cognitive ability? Can anyone tell me? So intelligence. Cognitive ability. What is cognitive ability? So basically, cognitive ability is related to using the brain. Intelligence, okay? Reasoning, all this interpretation, all this, okay? So the person who got proper sleep, so they, their cognitive ability is better than those whose sleep is deprived. And they can, like, it promotes sharp thinking also, okay? And the one point you already said, the sleep helps in proper growth and development. And another point is, now the uh, Navi is saying about the emotional hygiene, not the depression, anxiety, how important it, it is to think about our own thought. So sleep also is the one factor which is affecting our emotional hygiene, okay? You might have observed, or you might have observed yourself, like when you didn't sleep, next day you will get like, you will get anxious faster than normal one. Or those people who are depressed, they, they, they don't get proper sleep. Their whole sleep cycle is disturbed. So that's why they suffer more depression. No, they goes into more depression. So that's why sleep is very important. Now the thing is, I want to like uh I want to ask like one thing, okay. So this you have to be sincere with me. How many of you think that sleeping is a waste of time? When we sleep, we are wasting our time. When we sleep, we are not being productive. Instead, we should... Sir, sleeping is so important. Yeah? yeah. It is important part of our life. Sir? Yes? Sir, I feel that sleep is very important for our body, for our life. Yes. Sleep, no, the, no, you all are like good. No, you all doesn't have this misconception about the sleep, like sleep being improductive. So the thing is, in, in our real world, the people used to think like, if we sleep, we are being impro like not productive enough, okay? But the thing is, the sleep is important as we are having food, right? We are respiring like this, sleep is, sleep is equally important, okay? So, Basically, actually, how, uh, how like adult human beings should have at least like eight hours sleep, okay, seven point five to eight hours sleep. And you know what? In India, average people sleep only six point five hour. So that means most of the people are sleep deprived, okay. So you should sleep at least how many hours? How many eight hours? hours. Eight, eight hours. hours. Eight, eight hours. hours. Eight, eight, eight hours. hours. Eight so okay and you shouldn't oversleep also now let's discuss about the yes, topic goal. And yeah now we have discussed about the sleep no let's go a little deeper now when we go into when we go into the sleep we have different stages okay so suppose you put your head against the pillow okay now the moment you put against the head you're against pillow what happened you start sleeping no after some time so the first stages of the sleep, no, that is called yes. stage one. Then we have stage two, then stage three. Now the when we are in the deepest sleep, no. So when your mother try to wake you up, but you are like you have no idea what is going on outside. So that time you are on the deepest stage. During that time, what happened? Let's say this cat is in the deepest stage. Now tell me what is happening, okay, by seeing this video. Can you tell me what is happening? But slowly, slowly, the height is going. I It is going to be sleep. The cat is sleeping. She is feeling sleepy. I got the answer. Thank you so much. I got the answer. So, the thing one student said the cat is moving his eyes very rapidly. No. Yes, you're correct. 
the REM during this sleep, the deepest stage of sleep, what happened is we tend to move our eyeball very fast here and there. So during that time, if someone like cat or if you have seen the rat moving their eyes very fast, no? During that time, you can say that, oh, this rat or cat is in a very deep sleep. It is, it is in the deepest stage of sleep, okay? And this is known as REM sleep, okay? Now we know what is REM sleep, no? REM sleep means rapid eye movement sleep, right? And we know the meaning why is it is known as rapid eye movement because when person reach this kind of deep sleep, their, their eyes move very fast, okay? So let's move to the next slide. Now what happened during this stage of sleep? Now when we reach this deepest stage of sleep, that, that is REM sleep, what happened? Our eyeball move very rapidly. Now some scientists say, no, when we move our eyeball rapidly, it is probably because we are dreaming. So this during this stage of sleep, what happened? We dream also, okay? So that's why we, we say REM sleep is also known as dream sleep or active sleep. So they say, suppose one dog is like biting you, okay? Dog is chasing you and biting you. So you will move here, you will move here and there, you will see here and there to see where you can hide things, where you can escape. So basically you are in dreaming, but your eyes are moving. So that, that's why the scientists are saying that we like, it is because of dreaming that our eyes are moving and it happens during the deepest stage of sleep. I think it's clear, no? Now the thing is, yes, sir. Yes. Now what happened? Suppose, like, uh, suppose, okay, we are thinking of, oh, dog is chasing us. We should, we should move. We should move like this. We are thinking, okay, if our muscle is like intact, what happens? What, is, what will be the possibility? Can anyone tell? Suppose we are dreaming, okay. So we there is there any possibility like we start moving here and there when we are in the sleep? Some people yes. move or some people do not move. Yes, some people move because of their sleep disorder. So most of the people, what happened when we are in the deepest stage of sleep, when we are dreaming, what happened? Our muscle become paralyzed. Why our muscle become paralyzed? So that we won't move here and there because it will be very dangerous, no? Suppose, okay, you, you are being chased by dog in your dream or oh, so you run away so if your muscle is not paralyzed you may move here and there and it will be dangerous no so that's why during the REM sleep our body is is designed in such a way that our muscle become paralyzed during the deepest stage of sleep okay now here the very important thing is this point during the REM sleep okay during the REM sleep means deepest stage of sleep our muscle become paralyzed and the last point you can see, you know, this is the important point. So here the REM sleep helps in long-term memory formations, okay? Now the thing is, you will learn all about this during the daytime, okay? So these are short-term memory. This won't last for a long time. So to convert into the long-term memory during the REM sleep, the conversion of short-term memory into the long-term memory happens. Is it clear, all of you? Yes, yes. sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay. Yes, sir. Okay. So, repeat. Yeah, yeah. Re uh, someone is telling me to repeat. Okay, I will repeat two point important thing. Okay, which is very important to understand before we go proceed to the next. So here during the REM sleep, our short term memory become long term memory. Okay. So that means memory is become more intact in our our head. Okay. Second thing is during the deepest stage of sleep, that is REM sleep, our muscle become paralyzed. Okay, so keep these two things. Now let's go to the next slide. Now what happened? If we have to understand the importance of money, no, what we have to do? We have to remove, we have to let go of money. No, if you have money, so you won't understand the value of money. If you have too much money, I'm saying. So to understand it, you have to remove like this. So here to understand the importance of the REM sleep, what we are doing is we are letting the rats not to sleep the REM sleep. Okay. Understanding? Here yes. you can see 
yeah you can see one uh, bucket no this is normal bucket where we wash the clothes yes yeah. this is my uh, this is one of our experimental experimental setup in our laboratory so we keep one bucket very simple one and we keep one flower pot okay we invert it and we keep it there okay on the top of it the rat is we kept okay we kept one rat now what we are going to do is we are going to let rat uh, we are going to let rat to sleep the normal normal sleep we are going to let rat to sleep okay but we are not going to let rat to sleep the deepest stage of sleep we are going to disturb this rat when he reach the deepest stage of sleep okay is that clear all of you yes sir yes sir yes sir okay okay, okay. now how are we yes, sir. how are we, yes sir yes now how are we going to selectively like disturb the rat not to sleep during the rem sleep how are we going to disturb its deep sleep how are we going to do that can anyone guess can if anyone tells me it's it will be very easy for me to proceed sir so we can so we can disturb him by uh, by uh, they can just uh, just tickle him no no Sir, sir, by shake the bucket. Sir, by, yes. by moving the bucket. See, one thing uh, I forgot to tell you: the surrounding things are water. Okay, surrounding things are water. Yeah. You can see right in the picture, one bucket, water is there. Surrounding water and one platform is there. Platform is made by inverted flower pot. Right? Can you see? Now, yes. Yes. How yes, sir. how this how this experimental setup is. disturbing selectively the rem sleep of this rat sir by putting by putting sir by putting water by putting water okay any other guesses sir by shouting by shouting okay any other to disturbing the mouse yes to disturbing the mouse by dropping the by dropping the mouse in the water and just take yeah, him so, out so the thing is when we will know that the rat is undergoing the rem sleep no so the, every time we have to uh dig, shout them shout or tickle like this we can't do no every night no every night we can't do morning rat will so normally like rat is nocturnal animal no so night it will be active morning it will be like sleeping every time we can't do it no so the thing one thing you might have like uh i, I one thing i've discussed already you know during the rem sleep what happened our muscle our muscle get paralyzed and paralyzed yeah now you can see no yes. yes now what you can see is the platform is not that big to rat to enjoy like right sleep very comfortably right rat has to use yes, its, rat has to use its muscle to muscle to comfort yeah make it comfortable and sleep right when it reach the deepest stage of sleep what happen is the rat the, if its muscle will get paralyzed okay when it muscle get paralyzed what happen rat cannot comfort itself so rat falls into the water are you getting what i am saying yes sir yes sir yes sir yes sir yes sir, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. yeah so in this way the rat sleep is getting disturbed why because when it reach the deepest stage of sleep what happen the rat muscle become paralyzed and it falls into the water and it wakes up okay then again it climbs on the this platform it try to sleep but it could sleep only the previous stage of sleep like first two but it when it reach the deepest stage of sleep again the muscle paralysis happen now this cycle will repeat so we are keeping rat on in this setup for almost 10 days or 12 days okay so in this way the rat will have more effect and it this effect will definitely affect on the neuron no okay now let's go to the next slide now see now this experimental setup is for checking the memory so space memory suppose if i hide like i is suppose no one from your school to your uh, home you know the way right how many of you know the way from school to home So I know, sir. Sir, I know. 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 S
Yes, sir, I know. Yeah. Sir, I know. yeah. So you all know where is your school, where is your home. You know the way. So like this, we are checking the red memory, red space memory. Okay. Now just watch this video. I will explain you. So let me explain you just about this. Now you have seen the uh, water maze. This big tub you have seen, right? So this big tub yes. is filled with water, okay? So there you have seen a small platform is there, okay? So during the training, what happens like this? He filled the water, but he filled one centimeter below the platform. That means the platform is visible to the rat, okay? So water is one centimeter below the platform. And he checked the temperature. Why he checked the temperature? Because if it is very cold, the rat will get disturbed and experiment will, experiment will get disturbed, no? So he want water to be at moderate condition, okay? Conducive to the rat swimming. Now this is called training, okay? Let's see now what happens. He checked the temperature. See, he made sure, no, the water level should be one centimeter below the platform so that the rat can see it. So this is during the training session, okay? Okay, sir. So you guys all can see, right? This rat is untrained, okay? So this rat is swimming in this pool for the first time. So what this scientist is doing is, this scientist is letting the rat to swim, okay? And he is teaching this rat that you don't have to swim all the way around, okay? You can I mean, reach like this, you can enjoy, you can enjoy it by, there is one platform in the middle where you can rest, okay? But this rat, since it's first time, so this rat want to like doesn't know there is a platform, and that's why he's swimming all across. Okay, are you guys getting it? What, what is experiment is all about? Yes, so sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay. Yes, sir. Yes, yes, sir. Yes. Yes, sir. Yes. Yes, sir. So, so this scientist is guiding, no? This scientist is guiding the rat that there is an area. So this rat has to know now, has to memorize the area. There, okay. Rat will refuse to stay, no, because rat is like a little bit anxious also because it's a new environment, no. Now the rat has, rat has come to know that, oh, this is the way I can escape, no. So like this, we give training for almost like 10 days. We give regular training, okay. Every day we give training to the rat that, oh, like, you, like this, you can escape. So 
the rat has to memorize the area where this platform is there. Okay, so it is like memorizing the space. Oh, here is my platform. So if I'm if I have to swim here, I can't swim here continuously. Okay, so that's why I have to sit there, take rest, right? You know. Yes. Yes. Now, like during in school, your teacher will teach you for one to two months. Then they will take test. No, like this, we also teach rat. Okay, where is the platform? Like almost ah uh, ten days continuously, we teach them. Then on the level day, we take the test. Okay, now how we will take the test? See. Application got stuck. Yes. Now what he did? What he did to take the test? What he did? Can anyone tell me? To take the test, what he did? Sir, he put. Sir, he put a powder in the powder. One by one, please. One by one. Sir, because of network issue, the video has been stopped. Oh. Yes, sir. The video has been stopped. Or something is. In the water, powder, like something is put in the water. I stop the video. I stop the video right now. I I I just want to ask the question. Okay. Please can I say? Sir, he put some. Yes, yes, yes. Sorry, sorry. Sir, so can you show it again? Powder on that. So can you show it again? Sir, he pour some chemical powder. Uh, do I can I show again from which part? From the yes, video. Yes, sir. Yes, yes. Yes, sir. 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 And he take the test, sir. When he take test, yes. Uh, some people I think they understood what is happening. So some people they didn't understand. I will show you. The, I will show you the video again. Okay. So video is not the problem. Uh, so because uh, there is some network issue, your video, uh, your video has been stopped. Uh, okay. I will play again. Okay. I will play it again. Just uh, observe. Okay. So this time I won't just. Yeah, from the beginning, I will show. Okay. Now, can you guys see the video? Is yes, there any network sir. issue? Yes, sir. No, sir. Yes, sir. Okay, I'm playing. No, sir. No network. How about? No, sir. Uh, Roy, sir, what to do? Shall I proceed? Uh, okay, I will show it once again. Yes, 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 sir. Yes, oh, you can. Okay, so I'm not. I'm going to pause here to explain again. So here we are training rat. Okay, so we are. This is the first time th this rat is swimming in the this uh, water. Okay, pool. So 
first time so rat doesn't know that there's a platform okay so that's why rat is swimming all across and rat is very curious so this will cover all boundary to see what is what is its new environment and all this now 60 second will wait okay to rat to discover the platform by itself when it can't discover the platform by itself then the scientist has to guide the rat that there's a platform with a finger right but the rat doesn't agree because rat is anxious. Rats want to explore more. So we used to keep rat again on the platform. Then after some point, the rat will understand that, oh, the platform is the only way it can rescue from the water, right? So like this, we give training for around 10 days, okay? So here the rat has to memorize the space where the platform is located, okay? Now is the test section now. Now can like last time one uh, student is saying no, uh, what is happening? So how he is taking tests? How he is taking tests? He hide. He hide the platform. He hide the yes. platform. Yes, exactly. Very, very good, very good. So he is hiding the platform. No, how he is hiding? He put more water, so that's why the platform is one centimeter below the water. And again, he put powder, white powder, which is non toxic to the rat. No, so in this way, the platform is hidden. Now, the rat has to use his memory, no, to reach the platform. Now, let's see how rat will perform after undergoing mini training session. So now you have seen no, how this rat is performing. After going through the training session, the rat, it doesn't roam here and there. The rat knows that, oh, platform is there. So he will directly go, no? So this way we will test the memory. So some rat, even though undergoing mini training session, like this, still they struggle to find the platform, okay? Now we are going to relate with a REM sleep, okay? Okay, now you guys can see now. Can you guys see my cursor? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay, yes, sir. So here. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay, now, let's, now yes. let's focus here, okay? Let's focus. Yes, sir. So you can see here the black round, no? This is a tub, okay? So this is a big tub where there's a pool of water and rat is rat used to swim, okay? So here control is written, no? On the top, control and the REM sleep. Controls are the one the rat are the rat who got proper sleep, proper REM sleep, okay? Whereas the REM sleep is the one, the rat who didn't get the proper sleep, okay? So basically see here, right, your right side is the one who didn't get the proper sleep, okay? Your left side is the one who got the proper sleep, okay? The control, control side is the one who got the proper sleep and the REM sleep is the one who didn't get the proper sleep. Is that clear, all of you? Yes, sir. Yes. Yes, sir. So this no control yes. here. Control is controls are the one rat who got the proper sleep. Okay, here the REM sleep what are the one who didn't get the proper REM sleep. Okay, now let's see their performance. Who will reach the platform first? Can you tell me? Those who got the proper sleep or those who didn't get the proper sleep? Which kind of rat? Those who got the proper sleep. 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 Okay, this rat reached the, see, now the control, uh, this, those rat who got the proper sleep has already reached the platform. They already got to know the position, okay, where the platforms are there. Now see, those rat 
who didn't get the proper sleep see their memory oh my god after undergoing 10 days training see they can't find the location still see they are struggling no yes sir yes sir they are still struggling so yes sir, yes, sir. So do you think like, can we apply this to the human being also? When we don't sleep properly, our memory is getting affected. Can we apply? Yes, sir. Do you think? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes. Sir. Yes. So here, one very really important yes, lesson sir. we can take it from here is sleep is very really important in memory. Now, people used to say like, oh, sleep is important because it helps in the memory like it helps in converting the short-term memory into long-term memory now but they have no like uh, evidence they, they they don't have any what to say in hindi we say sabut sabut ka hai now here is the evidence you can see you no know, those right who got the proper sleep they they memorized they they knew where exactly the platform is those who didn't get the proper sleep they are still looking for the platform that means those sleep those right who didn't get the REM sleep properly, their memory is getting affected. Now let's see the down one, okay? So this, there is an area in our brain which is very important, okay? This area is known on a hippocampus. Just, just remember the name, okay? Hippocampus is the area in our brain which is very important for memory formation. So what we have did, what we have done is, we have taken one one neuron from this those who got the proper sleep those who didn't get the proper sleep okay so these two neurons so you can see the neuron left and the right what is the difference you can see in these two neurons you can see a neuron sir. here moving yes yes sir it is sir the where the sir, control in the control one You can take an example of like trees, no? Trees. These two neurons look like a tree, no? Look like a roots, our like plant roots. So what is the difference you can see? So, first there is the right. Yes, yes, yes. The control one, they are more roots and the rent sleep one are not more, they are less. Yes, yes. Exactly. Yes, exactly. Thank you so much for this answer. Very good. So what is happening is those control one, the one who got proper sleep, their root density is more. Their de root density is more. Those who didn't get proper sleep, their root density is less. So what is what we can learn from it? If we didn't get the proper sleep, what is happening? What can we learn from it? We should have proper sleep so we can have long-term memory power. Yes. So the thing is... We need to take, we some, uh, we need to take proper sleep. Yes. We need to take proper sleep. That to continue is one. Why? Because if we do not sleep properly, what is affecting? Our neuron is affecting. Our neuron density is getting decreased and our memory is getting impaired. We cannot locate where exactly the where exactly the platform is no so this is what take away from this slide okay now let's go to let's go to the next slide okay now here okay now this is uh this video i have taken from the uh my laboratory okay the rat disney world now there is two rat okay two world rat disney world and rat depression world okay now what we have done is the rat mother will give some pups no 12 12 to 16 pups so pups means rat this uh rat children's no pups small small rats yes so sir. what we yeah so 12 16 are there okay so we have six rat we keep together in one chamber where there are many or uh, playful things are there okay so this rat can stay with their siblings six siblings they can enjoy many things in other world the rat depression world this rat are isolated okay so they are staying in chamber they are getting food and everything okay the except they are not getting is they are not they, they don't have friends they don't have siblings to play with and they don't have a playful things okay 
Now I'll show you the video, okay? So this is a small clip I have taken in my laboratory. Sorry to interrupt, sir, but the video is stuck. No, Shall I play it again? No, sir. Shall I play it again? No, sir. Yes, sir. You can play it again. Yes, sir. Okay, I'm I'm playing it again. Okay. Are you all enjoying this video? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. So this red is named, this red bit is Vistar red, okay? Vistar red. So this can be domesticated. So many people, like foreign people or like this, some people, they like to keep rat, no? This is the domesticated cat, okay? We can train them properly. They have like, they have very good intelligence. They learn things, okay? So the thing is, you can see in this like experimental setup, there is a spinning wheel. So where they like to run, okay? So this exercise will have immense effect on their memory, one thing. And they are burrowing animal, no? They, 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 they like to burrow under the soil like this. So we don't have soil here, but we kept the tunnel so that they can go under tunnel, they feel. Then they are still, so we keep the hanging also. And we keep different, different A rat will have like more enjoyment. We sometimes keep tissue paper. Sometimes this, you can see the air, air plug, no? Where we used to remove our air wax all this new new thing we give so in this way we brought up like this so this is a very long-term experiment from the small kid we have raised them to the very big and then we did the experiment so almost it took us four or five months to do the experiment and some rat here which are isolated from the sibling and without any uh, kind of like playful things so the question is now my question is okay those rat which are which are grown up in the rat Disney world and those rats which are in the rare in the rat depression world. Who will have a better long-term memory? The Disney world. Disney world. Rats have Disney world. Yeah. Disney, Disney world. Disney world. Disney world. Who is Boy. more likely to show depression and anxiety? Who is more the likely to show depression? World. Yes. yes, yes, exactly. So we have conducted this experiment. Yeah, so my question is, there are two different types of rat in two different worlds. One, one in rat's depression world and one in rat's Disney world, no? After they grow up, who will show better memory? Sir, okay. sir rat in Disney world. Yes, right. 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 Yes. Right. 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 Exactly. You all are right. Okay. And the second is who will have a better like uh, what do you say? Who are more prone for suffering from depression and uh, anxiety? Depression. Depression. So, so do you think like is it applicable to human being also? Yes, sir. Yes, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Can you please? Can you? Can one of you please tell us your experience like this in real life? Like, can you replicate? Sir. Yes. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Sir, when I am playing with my friends or family members, I like very much feel better, 
गुड नॉलेज है एंड their behavior pattern their brain everything is matching with the human being okay so that's why we do the we do experiment on rats okay so here if this happen for the long time no so we are keeping rat isolated for the long time so that's why it is affecting on their brain and then it affects on their memory so in this way whatever experiment we are conducting here okay this results are similar to the human world okay so I think I'm going to wind up the uh, lecture. So, any of one of you, do you have any question? You can go ahead. Okay. Thank you. No question. No question. No uh, any question, sir? Uh, yes. Okay. Pari, Pari, can you please tell me your question? Yeah, Pari has raised her hand, and then next, uh, no, sir, is... I don't have any question. Thank you. Acha, okay. Agarwal, sir, so I have. So I have. Ah, uh, okay. Shoria, please go ahead. Yes, sir. Sir, as uh, we are sleep, uh, going to sleep, and before that. we have watched some horror movie and uh, and have some fun and so according to that if we have watch any horror thing so why we have the dreams of horror in our sleep yes very good That's question right. very good question okay so one thing we know that our brain is a network of the neurons right so all neurons are connected are you all agree with me are you all agree yes sir Yes. Yes. Our brain consists of hundred billion yes, neurons. All neurons are connected. Okay. Now the second yes, thing, we have area in our mid brain which is very important for sleep. Okay. So one two area is there. When this area is getting activated, okay. When we trigger this area, we what we do? We sleep. There is another area when we activate this one. What we do? We do not sleep. Okay. Are you getting? there in our brain in the middle a mid brain yes, sir. we have four brain mid brain hind brain yes. in mid brain we have two area one area when you activate it when you switch on the button what happens it make us sleep the another area when you switch on this a this this one this part of the brain okay we do not sleep so there's a two area okay now there's another area in our brain which is really connected with the emotions okay when we feel sad all this this brain area is amygdala okay amygdala remember it okay so anything sad happen if you watch horror movie horror movie means we will get the th we will get thrill so this part of the neuron will activate the part which don't let us sleep okay which we don't which don't let us sleep are you getting what i am saying okay yes sir in this way yes sir in this way it is getting affected okay now mahi uh, mahi has answer mahi has question sorry uh, yes yeah mahi, sir if, but uh, okay after after mahi riya okay sir what sir what happen if we will sleep more than 10 hours yes sleeping more than 10 hours is not good we say over sleeping okay over sleeping is not good because it will make us lazy over sleeping is never good so we say there is one poor no access of everything is not good no so over sleeping is also not good it will make us lazy and it will also like now in this case you can say that we are being unproductive because we are over sleeping so we can sleep for 7.5 to 8 no 10 hours is way too much and it yes. is not that necessary sometimes what happen yeah. so over compensation also happen okay sometimes what happen we today we didn't sleep properly 4 hours only we slept okay next day what happened we sleep for 10 hours 12 hours why because yesterday we didn't sleep properly so that's why it is getting compensated so in this case fine all fine okay but if you are sleeping regularly 10 hours 10 hours 
not fine. Okay, are you guys getting me? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, one. Yes. Now, Ria. Yes, sir. Okay, Ria, you can ask question. Ria. So, why do we dream? Why do we dream? Yes, very good question. Now, here, the scientist has not exactly like answer, okay? So, this dream. So, there are many questions like, do rat and cat also dream? Because their eyes also move, no? You have seen the rat rapid eye movement. We do, uh, we definitely dream, no? So whatever we are dreaming, the scientist hypothesis is, whatever we do on regular uh, regular activity like this, whatever is there in our subconscious mind, when we dream, it comes to our consciousness. Are you getting what I'm saying? Okay, now yes, sir. I'm thinking yes. in normally, yes. I'm thinking, okay, oh, I need a new book, okay, because my old book got over. I'm just thinking, okay, during daytime. Not that consciously like thinking. Or night time, I get dream of getting new book from my mother and all this. Why? Because already I'm thinking during the daytime. It is there in my subconscious. So it comes to the consciousness when we sleep. Okay. So any other question? Sir, I have a doubt. Uh, yes, sir. Sir, I have. Yes, yes. Yeah, Agarwal. Shuri Agarwal. Yeah. Yes, sir. Yes. Sir, I have noticed that. I have dreamed many of times and uh, when I wake up, I forget it everything. But little much incidents I remember. So why yes. Is it? yes, so we have two types of dream, okay? One dream we get during the night, cheap sleep, okay? So there's two kinds of dream, REM sleep dream and the non-REM dream, okay? During the REM, whatever the dream you are getting, you will forget, you will forget, okay? In the morning when your sleep is about to like not that deep, so during that time, the dream you are getting, no? So this you will remember. So there's two kind of dream. So you are getting the dream, the one when you go into the deep sleep, the REM sleep, okay? That's why, Agarwal. Yes. Uh, okay, thank you. Sir, I have one doubt. Yes, sir. I have one doubt. Okay, uh, after uh, Agarwal, which one? Ashish, no? Then Ria, okay? Uh, yes, sir. Yeah, go ahead, please. Sir, sir, do you believe that alternate realities exist? Alternate realities? Can you please explain me what is alternate realities? Is it related sir, to... Sir, that's what was my question, sir. Alternate realities are something in... Uh, something which is created by ourselves. We don't really know if it exists or not, but yes, it sir. is a place where there is totally different one person and another that is hallucination so, sir, right hallucination yeah. something sir. is not there but you you make it so it's like delusion or hallucination right yes uh so what is your question so sir uh -huh. so sir if if alternate realities exist can we say that uh whenever we sleep our conscien consciousness is gone right so, sir, can we say that our consciousness travel to that world that is not existing or existing? Uh, can the you alternate please, reality. Uh, repeat your question. I didn't get properly. Alternate reality. Sir, sir, yes, yes, yes. Sir, whenever. Mm -hmm. Sir, according to me, alternate reality is a different world which is connected to ourselves by our feelings and minds. So whenever we sleep, can we say that our consciousness travel to that world uh, and our consciousness is lost? That's why we sleep. Exactly. Actually, alternate world things like this are like delusion only. No, you suppose, uh, have you watched one movie named Shutter Island? Shutter Island? Shutter Island, no, have sir. any one of you? No, sir. So in this movie, what happened is, you know the Titanic hero? Leonardo DiCaprio, Titanic hero? Okay. Yes. Yeah. So yes, sir. Is, yes, sir. He, think, he, think, he used to think, okay, he is the detective. Okay. He is looking for the murderer. Okay. But everyone knows that he is the one who murders. Okay. Who, he is the one who do, who all, like, who conduct all the criminal acts. But he used to think, oh, I'm going to, I'm looking for the detective. I, I'm the detective looking for the criminal. He himself is the criminal, okay? So in this way, hallucinated. He is hallucinated and delusion. 
Now there are some brain disorder like schizophrenia. Schizophrenic is a disease condition. Okay, so in this person undergoes hallucination, delusion, thinking that he is he 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 assume himself like oh I'm Shahrukh Khan like this. He thinks like this. Okay, in this case, I think during the sleep or this the brain activity it is exactly like abnormal only, not natural. Okay. Okay, is that clear? So yes, this sir. is a disease yes. condition, disorder condition. Okay, brain disorder. Uh, can you, Navya Agarwal? Yeah, Navya sir, Agarwal. My doubt is that what is the form of uh, REM sleep? REM sleep, REM. Yes. What is the REM sleep? Oh, Navya, I, I said before, no, in the presentation, in the beginning. Ram means you have seen the cat moving his eyes here and there. Have you seen? Have you seen Navya? Have you seen the cat yes, moving sir. his eyes here and there when he's in the deep sleep? So this stands yes, for sir. rapid eye movement. R E M stands for rapid eye movement sleep. Okay. okay. Did you understand? Rapid yes, eye movement. Yes, sir. So, eye movement. No, okay. Uh, Priya, who asked? Uh, Priya, sir, can I ask? Yeah, yeah, Ria, please yes, go sir. ahead. Yeah, yeah, Ria. After Ria, Priya, okay? Priya, Priya. Sir, now you have to. Sir, now you have told that uh, when we sleep, so when we sleep, so like uh, we are thinking of like we have to buy a book because the before book so sir we get that dream only but sir why this has happened that uh while we are not thinking about something like that so that comes in our dream yes exactly so some things like we unknowingly like we have observed somewhere in like in dream some some person will come which is like we wish you wish which we don't know exactly but thing is you might have seen him somewhere in bazaar when you went though you don't know him like it remains in subconscious okay our eyes see here like this here so whatever some things like remain unconscious you are not consciously looking at him but it remains in our subconscious are you getting it is a very complicated thing the scientist also can't exactly explain how are we getting the dream the procedure no they can't tell us why like uh like process how are we getting the dream the scientists can explain how 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 our heart beats to circulate but cannot explain how we dream but the thing is one thing is certain that whatever we yes. observe unconscious consciously or unconsciously during the daytime it comes during the night okay dream it comes in the night okay ria yes sir uh, Okay, now next question, Priyanshi, please ask your question. Yes, sir. Can we control our dreams or continue dreaming? Uh, uh, can you come again? Yes, sir. Uh, I'm saying that can we control our dreams or continue dreaming? No, no, no. We can't control our dream. We can't control our dream. It is involuntary. It is involuntary. Okay. Okay, sir. Hmm. We uh, can we control our food digestion? No. Yeah, like this. No, sir. Yeah. So any other? Uh, no, sir. Critic, 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 Kash. Yes, sir. Yeah, can you? So my question is that when we sleep at the afternoon, we sleep for one two hours, but when we sleep at night, we sleep for seven eight hours. Yes, this is related to our biological clock. Okay, so we human, our brain has one organ called pineal gland. So in our body, we have different glands. No, do you know what are the different glands we have in our body? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Liver. Yes, yes. Ria, can you tell me one by one? Liver, you said. Okay. The liver gland. Liver. The liver is the largest gland. Yes. Good. Now here, let me tell. So we have pineal gland in our forebrain. Okay. 
this pineal gland will release a melatonin okay hormone name melatonin m e l a t o n i n melatonin okay this melatonin will it act as a biology clock so suppose you are sleeping and you always sleep at 9 o'clock okay you wake up at 6 o'clock next day you you try to sleep at 8 o'clock but you can't sleep why because here the brain is set already that oh no habit yeah so you are sleeping at nine o'clock so that's why you that's why you you you, you get dizziness you no know, sleepiness and all this so here in this way our brain our body is designed in such a way that we sleep more during the night and sleep less during the daytime so that's why we are diurnal animal okay some animal they are nocturnal animal they remain active during the night time and they sleep during the daytime so example is can anyone give me example nocturnal owl animal? oh yes and rat so rat they make night they make so much noise so all the experiment we are conducting during the night time because rat are active during that time okay so during morning if we do the experiment what will happen we are disturbing their sleep right because they are already this is like their sleeping timing daytime uh, any more question no sir uh, raise it. no, no sir. sir okay okay so any doubt in presentation or any external question you can you guys can go ahead if i if i can answer i will answer if i don't know answer let's search together in the google no so google everything is there information so no. doubt no. mm -hmm. so um so while that rat was moving so that so why was that water kind of black kind of water oh yeah so uh, we painted this <clears throat> actually we painted it okay uh, our vessel no so you can see the tub big tub is there no we color it black why we color it black because the rat is white no uh, Ria asked no Ria yes sir very good question sir, very, good question. Okay. very good question I appreciate a lot why because here you can see no the experiment is, let me show you the screen again uh, I'm presenting. I will show you here. Am I presenting? Yes, already. So I will show you here the uh, diagram. Okay. So my, our tub is black in color, right? Okay. Yeah, here. So I'm sorry to interrupt because your that that tub is not visible in the screen. Okay. I'm sharing it again. Yes. This is very good question, okay? So scientists should have really like scientists should ask why this? Why this always? This is a one of the characteristic of, of scientists. See here this up is black in color right why we paint it black is because here camera is there no top you can see now can you see the picture yes sir yes sir yeah so red color is red color is white okay and we kept the black background black right the back background black so that the camera can capture the red red's movement no because red we are using the white with the red so we can easily capture its movement by the camera if the top background is white. Suppose if top background is white means what will happen? We cannot capture the rat movement, right. no? Is it clear? We need the opposite color. Yes, we need the opposite color to track the rat's movement, no? So camera is the one which is tracking the rat's movement. Okay, very nice question. Any other? Thank you, sir. Mm. So I think uh, how much time we spent? Are we going beyond the time limit? Uh, I think 
Yeah, yeah, one hour is like perfect, no? Yes. So if yeah. you have further more doubt, you can ask, or you can leave. Uh, you can you can send message to me next time. I will whenever I get time, I will respond back to you. And thank you so much for your question. You guys are very curious and very cute. Thank you. Welcome, sir. Thank you. Bye. Thank you for thank you for bye. 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 Have a nice day, sir. Bye, bye, sir. 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 Yes, 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 yes. Palak, it's all right. Do you have Palak? Do you also have any question? No, sir. No, sir. I was. Okay, okay. All right, all right, all right. Yes, sir. Sir, shall I? No, I'm. Thank you so much for. Uh, your valuable time <laughs> from this is kerala hmm okay so everyone is leaving right thank you so much all of you navya palak i can see riza khan priyanshi welcome sir yes sir welcome bye sir have a nice day sir have a nice day bye sir thank bye, you sir bye 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 bye, -bye. Bye, sir. Thank you so much, sir. Bye, sir. Bye, Rolly. Bye, sir. Thank you for telling me. Bye, sir. Okay, Ria, you are saying some. Riza, Riza, you are saying something. Riza, Riza, Riza. Thanking you that. Uh, thank you for explaining or uh, giving a detail about REM sleep and memory. Oh, thank you so much. Uh, if you understood properly, it's my pleasure. Oh, yes you? sir okay. thank you thank you riza khan thank you yes sir thank you okay then rohit bhai uh... yes. yeah yeah no mark sir no mark thank you so much yeah yeah thank you thank yeah it was it was very nice here like students were able to connect it to their daily life and they were having a lot of curious questions and you also have gave them reply peacefully Yeah, very very nice question. Like I didn't expect student to ask this kind of question. Like somehow, like completely research oriented question they are asking. That's very good, no? Like why yes. this uh, background is black? Like this. I didn't explain them that there is a camera which one which is tracking the rat here. Yeah, yeah, very, yeah. Very yes. good question. Okay, okay, yeah. okay, sir. All right, all right, now and then see you, huh? Ah, okay, yeah. sure. Yeah, yeah. Bye. Nice. Take care. Take care.